Okay, so this is a quick tutorial on how to create a simple drum beat in Pro Tools. So this is the Pro Tools window, and first thing we want to do is create a new track. Make this an instrument track. Just create, and here it is. On the inserts column, which if you've not got, make sure you've got inserts A to E checked just here. And in here, select plugin instrument, we're going to use the structure free instrument. Once that's open, it's got some patches down the left hand side. We don't want this sine wave one because it sounds, well, doesn't sound what, like we want it to. So we're going to get rid of that and we're going to add a new patch, which is going to be the studio drums patch from the structure factory libraries. That'll take a second to load. And once it's loaded, Make sure this track is selected, on to record, and when you play the notes on your keyboard, it should play the notes of the drums. Okay, so once we've got that in, we're going to right click on the lane and go edit in MIDI editor, open in MIDI editor. Okay, so now when we press these buttons on this keyboard roll here, we get the sounds from the studio drums. I'm going to scroll down a little bit further so we get to the first octave. Now, the most important ones that you'll need will be the C, which is the bass drum, the E, which is the snare drum, and the F sharp, which is the hi-hat. So, I'm gonna go for a really simple disco beat. So, we'll have a bass drum on every beat of the bar. The beats of the bar are shown by these dark blue lines. You may want to zoom in if your grid looks like this. You might want to zoom in so that you can see them a bit clearer. This might be enough actually because you can see at the top there, that's bar one, beat one, bar one, beat two, bar one, beat three, etc. And that's bar two, that's bar three, that's bar four. So a bass drum on every beat of the bar. Just do one bar for now because we can always loop it later. We're going to do a snare drum on the back beat, that's beats two and four. One there, and one there. Let's see what that sounds like. Let's just bring up the transport window. And press play. Okay, just needs its hi-hat now. So, closed hi-hat is on the F-sharp. Open hi-hat is on the B-flat. So, I'm going to put a closed hi-hat on the beat, on every beat, and I'm going to put an open hi-hat between every beat. So we should end up with a really simple little disco beat going on now. So let's have a listen to that. And there we go. Very simple beat. And the good thing is, we don't need to keep typing it into have bars and bars of it. Once you've got it there, we can loop it round. Just hold down on here and click loop. And then when you drag this little event out, It'll loop it for as long as you like. And then you can put anything else over the top of it. So that's how to create a simple disco beat on Pro Tools. Subscribe and there'll be plenty more tutorials coming soon.